Hello everyone, I hope everyone's doing good. So last night uh, we went to the annual Rib Fest here in London, Ontario. We go every summer and yeah, it was a beautiful evening. We always go in the evening because it's just too hot during the day. But last night it was just a beautiful, beautiful evening. And uh, yeah, it was, um, I think they're gonna have record crowds this year because the whole weekend is supposed to be rain free and um, hopefully. Um, so yeah, it was a wonderful turnout and I love just sitting down, eating my ribs and watching the people go by. I love people watching. So yeah, it was, it was, it was great. And um, they also had the Scentsy vendor there and every year I pick up some Scentsy uh, wax melts. So I did get all new ones except one that I have purchased previously. But I did get uh, new ones and it was buy five, get the six bar for free. So I will start um, with uh, Vanilla Oud and I love Oud scents. Um, now it's actually Oud is the oil from the agar uh, tree and it's been used for thousands of years. Um, uh, it's used in men's cologne. It's uh, used for like um, a lot of cultures use it in religious ceremonies. It's, it's just used quite a bit. And uh, yeah, so this one is the Vanilla Oud. And Oud is a very musky, sensual scent. It's, it's a sexy scent. And I get a little bit of the vanilla, just sweetens it up a little bit. Um, it's almost like it's verging towards like a leather type of scent too. So, oh yeah, that's just right up my alley. I really, really do like that one. Mm, it is it's very it's it's soft it's it's not a cloying kind of scent um it's just very soft very musky and uh yeah really good and then this one i get every year and that's uh cozy fireside now i've always like i think i looked at the description and it, i don't think it mentioned clove but when i smell it i pick up clove there is cinnamon in there it's not red hot, it's not overly earthy, it's kind of right in between there. So there, it definitely is a cinnamon, but I get clove also. But it is just a deep, rich, uh, spicy scent. Oh, it's just perfect for around Christmas time. And then this one, uh, I was kind of intrigued by this because I like this combination when I'm eating chocolates, and it's Mandarin Toffee Treat. And yeah, you can definitely smell like the mandarin and you can smell a, a sweet toffee in there. It's, the toffee is a little bit uh, salty, but not too much. But it's very, very bright. Hopefully it'll it, probably soften up a little bit when it's, um, when it's melting, but it is kind of like a sharp kind of scent. It's probably not everyone's cup of tea, but just reminds me of those... Uh, cream, orange cream filled chocolates. I just love those. But yeah, it was, it's very, very unique. And uh, this is Accidentally in Love. And this one's actually um, a citrus scent. Very, very bright. But I get citrus and I also, I get ginger in there also, the brightness of the ginger. Oh, it's a really, really good combination. It's just so bright. Oh, really like that one. And then Mojito Mambo. So, yeah, whenever I go down south, I like to um, drink my mint mojitos. They're quite refreshing. And I also really like grasshopper. I think they're called grasshoppers. They have the um, mint and chocolate. Oh, I just, I just suck that back on the beach there. Oh, this is so bright. You get that mint. It's not a, uh, it's not like a, um, spearmint peppermint it's like a freshly picked mint like authentic natural mint and you get a bit of that lime but i think the mint's kind of a uh, little bit more dominant than the lime oh but that brings back some <laughs> memories there really like that one and then i asked if they had sheer leather because patricia knows the toes on her channel had mentioned about these uh, leather scents and i really do like them i love them for my historical shows and documentaries 
Uh, so I asked for sheer leather and she said they had sold out. So they did have saddle up. And then um, last year I did buy weathered leather. So I find the weathered leather it is, it's very sharp, like, it's like, um, freshly tanned leather. <laughs> it's, it's very, very strong and very, uh, potent. I mean, this definitely smells like, uh, fresh leather. And then this one, Saddle Up, oh, I don't think I showed you. This is a lot softer, a lot softer, a lot muskier. It's, uh, maybe not quite as, like, in your face leather as this one. This one's definitely more soft, a lot softer. So yeah, there is, um, I'm actually gonna try to mix these two to see see what I get also, but they, they definitely are different. This one, oh, it's in your face leather and this one is much softer. So, so those are the um, Scentsy Wax Melts that I purchased. And they also had this other vendor, it's um, Sparta Candles. Um, I didn't buy anything, any candles or anything um, there this time, I controlled myself. But they um, did have this uh, candle warmer. Uh, now I do have the candle crock, which I use all the time. It's down near the kitchen. And it's the one you put the candle right inside. And this one, you just put the candle on top. So I thought I'd just use this one for upstairs. It was $12.99. So um, I thought I'd give that one a try. And then um, oh, I'll do these ones first. So uh, they did have um, some dresses on sale at the uh, festival. And they had, I think, two for 40. So they ended up being $20 each. And I showed Frank this one. He goes, oh, you got to get that one. I love that one. So it was just a little, like a little um, halter top one. But the design on the bottom was really, really nice. I just love that. So pretty. And yeah, I do like sundresses in like a really hot day. I just find them much more cooling than like shorts and a t-shirt kind of thing. I just find the, the wind gets up there and airs everything out. You know what I mean. Um, I just find them a little bit cooler. So uh, I really like the design on that. And then they had this one. And these colors I thought were just gorgeous. So again, it's like a halter top kind of design. And uh, there's this big pleat in front and then there's a couple of layers of the fabric. Um, so it's very, very flowy. It's kind of a bit longer at the, at the back and it's kind of all has all these little pleats on the back. So it looks just gorgeous. And I just absolutely love the colors and uh, and the design of it there. Oop. So pretty. And then I went to the garden center yesterday. They had a big sale on the, um, for the civic holiday weekend. And I got a couple of pots. They were on for 40% off, some really big pots. Um, but I didn't lug them up here because they're way too heavy. Um, but they did have... Uh, some of their new fall merchandise coming out. So they don't just sell plants. They sell a lot of like um, kind of seasonal knickknacks. And I saw this one and I thought it was super pretty. So inside is like the little fairy light. And I would light it up, but the battery's not working. So I picked one where the battery's not working. But anyway, just replace that. But they had a couple different designs. This one says find beauty in every day and they got the little jute ribbon there and then they have the little birds uh, with the fall leaves on there but that will look just it's going to look just stunning when it's uh, lighted up there so so pretty. Um, probably should have got another one to come think of it. They were like eight nine dollars so uh, very tempted to go back and get another one. It's just going to look so pretty lit up. So that's my little rib fest haul. So I hope you enjoyed. If you tried any of these scentsies, let me know how you like them. And um, everyone take care. Hope you're having a great weekend and uh, we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.